Why do narcissists try to make you jealous? They have to make you jealous. It tells them what your feelings and opinions are. They are always testing you to see how you might react because it tells them how much control they have over your emotions which is why they will often try to make you jealous they will bring a third person into the relationship in order to remain in control but without any communication between you and the third person except for the person who is manipulating you and if you get jealous they know that you want their attention and love you want them to belong to you and only you you want to keep them close to you because you love and care about them and there's nothing wrong with that love is a healthy thing but they're using it for a different purpose they're testing your love for them to see if they're still as effective as when they first acquired you because the more jealous and passionate you are about them it tells them they're still on good terms with you so then they don't have to worry about anything as long as you're still demanding their attention but when you stop responding to them in that way it's a red flag to them something must be going wrong it tells them that you don't care about them it tells them that you don't need them because they're no longer having an effect on you so that must mean that it's almost over they try to make you jealous because it tells them that you still care it tells them that you still want them it gives them a control when you desire to possess them when you fear losing them when you fear that someone else might want them and take them away from you it tells them that you're not going anywhere because you're still deeply involved you're still under their spell which is exactly what they want it's why they put you in these situations to make you jealous because it's not enough for you to tell them that you love them or care about them they need to see your emotional reaction they need to see your pain because that's going to tell them how much you care which is why they try to make you jealous so that you will react to the idea of them being with someone else and then they can observe your behavior to see how effective they are but a lot of it is under the radar so you won't even think that they're testing you they may talk about things that they're not even interested in things that they don't even care about but they're doing it just to test you to see how you will respond to it because that's going to tell them where you are in the mind it's going to tell them how you feel about them and it amuses them they enjoy doing it to you they enjoy seeing you do a lot of silly and difficult things in order to not lose them which is why they put you through all of these tests and they act like they're not happy with what you're doing because it makes you try harder it makes you do more so they have to do it they can never show their happiness and appreciation for what you're doing 
because that would put them at a disadvantage and they want to preside over you so they have to make you think that nothing you do is good or right so that you will always want to prove yourself so that you will always want to do more to keep them satisfied so that they will want to be with you it's all a game but it has a damaging effect on you because you feel like nothing you do is good enough you always have to be careful you always have to make an effort you're constantly walking on eggshells where you have to be extremely cautious about your words and actions because they're easily offended and upset so you're left feeling like you have to step up your game you have to improve your performance quality skills or talents because they can easily move on and find something better which is exactly what they want you to think they want you to think that it's easy for them to replace you they want you to think that they're used to having their way they're used to having whatever they want they're used to having things done according to their personal preferences and decisions it's all they know they experienced it so often so it's normal usual and familiar to them it's unsurprising it's what they expect they want you to think like that so you will fight to keep them so that you will try to possess them it makes life easier for them because you end up doing all of the work you end up being the only one who is trying to keep it together while they're sitting back and experiencing no problems in a situation that should be difficult and unpleasant they're going forward without any effort or struggle because they've tricked you into thinking that they are the prize that they are very valuable important and special so you think that they're worth the time money and effort you spend on them you make a special effort for them you inconvenience yourself you do things that you would not normally do so you don't lose them so someone else doesn't take them away when the whole thing is done just to test your uncertainties and lack of confidence in reference to them making you jealous because by them making you jealous you were under their control you were susceptible to their manipulation that's why they do it because it keeps you working it makes you do more and more to keep them with you because you don't want to lose them because they're making you think that they can easily move on and they have all of these people after them it puts you in a position to do everything you can do so that they are happy with you and they will keep you in that position for as long as they need you for as long as they have a use for you you're never going to be at peace you're never going to feel secure with them you're never going to feel like they want to be with you because they want to have an advantage over you so they have to keep you in this position where there's always something wrong or where there's always something that's not good enough so that you're always left trying to make them happy even though by the end of it you may be on your last legs you may be on your way out Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up. Share your thoughts in the comment section. 
hit the subscribe button to receive the notifications. If you would like to support the channel, you can donate at paypal.me slash narcsurvivor. You can book a one-on-one -on -one with me on my website, it's narcsurvivor.uk. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.